What's up, you guys? I'm Broderick Hunter, and we are on set shooting for our acid spread. I've been modeling about seven years now. This is my seventh year. Craziest model experience I've had. I was forced to put on some size nine shoes just to walk a show in Milan. <laughs> but it ended up landing me like a huge opportunity, so that was kind of crazy. I haven't forced myself into some nines. I ugh. <laughs> still feel the pain. My experience working with Miss Issa Rae, that was probably the funnest experience of my life because she's so energetic, she's so fun, and she's so like loving and inviting. Like, just sharing the screen with her, it was more so like talking to like one of my friends. It was, it was so fun just, talk, just being able to just vibe with her because she has such an open energy about herself and she has so much uh, wisdom and knowledge and she's just a fun person to be around. By far one of my favorite people I've ever met to this day. Everything I probably know about hair care, skin care, and self care has come from black women. Learning that from black women was, uh, has really helped me in my, in my journey, in my path, in terms of educating other black men. And so I feel like black women have always played such a huge role in, in, in our community and empowerment, especially uh, empowering black men as well. I, I really wish black guys would appreciate that a little bit more. Wash your face, invest in good cleansers, and a consistent workout regimen. Make sure that the clothes fit, first of all. <laughs> like thin is in, you know, everything's kind of like clothes are slim cut now these days. Just because it's tight does not mean it's right. I would just say invest in, uh, in knowing, like, the, knowing like, what really fits well and also uh, colors. You know, invest in and in try out different colors because different skin tones make the different colors pop, especially when it comes down to dark skin. My personal style switches so often. Like fall, I was kind of in like a, a vintage 90s type of vibe. I was wearing like windbreakers and stuff on the, on the red carpets. And in the summertime, I was really more of in like a leisure. I was wearing silks and loose fitting stuff, you know, kind of like a more Miami vintage -y vibe. So my vibe kind of switches, but I'm really just, honestly, I go for comfort and simplicity. I'm really all about being simple. My main advice right now for guys that are trying to start out is just to, con just to stay as present as possible and stay up to date as possible, meaning always putting out content, always you know, posting your photo shoots, uh, always putting yourself out there in the world of the internet to be discovered because now in days, you know, there's not too many people that are just getting discovered on the streets anymore. Everything's being discovered on social media. So you really kind of have to put yourself out there online because the masses are always looking for new faces and new things to gravitate towards and that's online right now. So just put yourself out there and post as much as possible of your content.